gonna see what happens. I tied some flies last night, you know, gonna give them a go. Gonna throw some bass baits at the same time, but yesterday we caught like 17 crappy bluegill, sunfish, two unidentified fish, which one of them, I don't know, I, you know, videoed it and then went back to double check because the camera was acting funny and it did not get the fish, but it looked like a gizzard chat or a thread fin chat, which... So things have changed a lot recently. Things have just been changing a whole lot. Um, I was calling on fish and the water's dropping, and I finally figured out what these bass are doing. Um, you know, they're running around and they're eating. They're running around and they're eating um, a lot of them. fresh. some blow-ups I probably got 15 blow-ups I just didn't get a single fish I had one fish hooked for a moment and then he got off so I don't know my flies that worked really good yesterday got really beat up it's only got one of its wings left and uh, second cast, got this fish right here. Nice, uh, nice little panfish, you know. I'm not into fishing with, uh, you know, certain types of things. So, you know, if I was a live bait guy, I'd take this and just throw it out there and probably smash a bass, but I'm not that guy. All right, guys, GoPro's having some problems. Hopefully we get this footage and it doesn't all just go to waste. I've had some new situations where things just kind of don't work for whatever reason. You know, you get new SD chips, you get this, you get a battery that's bad, things like that. But just caught another one. Uh, I'm not even sure if the other one got on film. So that's three fish and four casts, all around that five inch size, couple of bluegill sunfish. I'll show you one right now. goes he's gone he's yeah I mean right now that's I think what the bass are feeding on uh, I think they're post spawn right now all right guys so we've been fishing hard and uh, you know no bass you know through the fly most of the time you know, besides when we first pulled up and caught three within four casts, I mean, they were all five, six inch, you know, bluegill, sunfish. But now, uh, yeah, I haven't really seen any panfish anywhere else. And it's kind of, that's weird, this lake, this little pond, it's like, you know, it seems like that 80-20 rule really applies. 80% of the fish are in 20% of the water. It's just you know, I mean, it's just I fell in love fishing this one way and now I'm going to have to completely abandon that um, as much as I don't want to and just start doing what I think is best. And that's the hard part when you do so well on um, particular bait or two particular baits that you just can't really put them down. And that's hurting me right now the last couple trips. So I've got some baits rigged up to try new uh, styles 
uh, for fishing. I think the, you know, I think I, so see how it goes. Stay here's the deal. Here's the deal. Um, you know, nobody's catching fish out here. Uh, it's actually been so bad that a lot of the people that were coming regularly, they're not even out here. So it's a Friday. There's not a single person out here. Check it out, just got this nice, this nice, uh, yeah, the sunfish is pretty awesome. And that's, uh, I should do with this but I'm not gonna this is a bluegill I love the colors I don't know if you can see the blue or anything yeah beautiful beautiful fish Just pulled them out of a bunch of weeds. Nice fish right here. Oh yeah. It's a good one, guys. Look at that, guys. Beauty. It's a big end. ourselves a pretty good one. This one's fat. Oh. Look at this one guys. That's a nice fish. That's you know pretty. Oh yeah. Just got another guy.